Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome to another video. Um, I have to keep my voice down relatively quiet because it is like uh, six sixteen in the morning. We're leaving for London, which is Fulham away, in, a, in about half an hour, twenty minutes. Um, people are just getting up now, so maybe they hear that. Pure because they're going to work and whatnot. Um, but I'm off to Fulham, so I'm buzzing. Really excited. I've only had about four hours sleep. Pure because I'm too excited. I can't wait for this weird day. Um, really buzzing. Really. I mean, I might not, I might not look it now. I've only had four hours sleep, but honestly. I'm really excited. Um, thank you for all the support on my last video. Um, my dog didn't want to be in the video, unfortunately. He was too busy asleep. Um, but really looking forward to this one. Um, in terms of what do I want to see, uh, I'm expecting a strong team. Since nobody really played on Tuesday night. I mean, Randolph didn't play. Christy um, didn't have Fabio in. We didn't have obviously Claire was suspended. Um, there was no lead bitter. Might have took a knock against QPR. Hopefully it's off in series. He can be back in the team today. If not, Housen did a job, so Housen come back in. Um, Baker he didn't play. Um, obviously Bamford played. He might be able to play on the right. Fletcher played. He might be able to play on the right hand side as well. There being no Triore or Marvin Johnson could go right, downing on the left, and some longer through the middle. So. You know we have, you know we have, we have, we do have reinforcements in positions. Um, I'm really excited to uh, watch the team today. Um, don't get me wrong, it's a long journey. It's a long travel today. That's why we're leaving so early. It's a long journey. I probably just won't get home till early hours, but you know what I mean. I'm, I'm more than happy to do the travel to watch my team. Um, Bournemouth away will be even earlier than this. So yeah, I mean, well, well, essentially it'd be about ten o'clock, nine o'clock in the morning that we're leaving, and not getting home till early hours of the morning. So. No, as for Fulham today, um, you know they they are a strong team. They've got good players. They've got Norwood, Kearney, Sasson Young, um, great defence. Thomas Callas, obviously ex Borobelli, which he's on loan towards a few seasons ago. He did a job for us. He was really good. I really enjoyed watching him. But now he plays for Fulham, so hopefully it's on longer. We can um, cause chaos up in uh, obviously obviously up at the back four, but. I say, um, you know, if you have a pretty pacey attack today, we'll see how fun put up with it. Craven Cottage, uh, in terms of the stadium, I like it. It's not a bad little stadium. Um, been there once before, and we won 2-0. It'd be really nice to win again after doing this journey today. But, you know, uh, I'm excited. Borough fans, if you're watching this, have a safe journey up to the capital and a safe journey home. Also, Borough fans, if you're watching this, after the game, try and find the Borough fan TV, lads. I've been interviewed with Guesty and you know trying to give your opinions on the match and what and exactly what you've seen. Um, that's exactly what I'll be doing. Um, but I was hoping to see a good game today. Simple as that. Don't want to see a defeat ideally. I mean, if you lose and we give 100% today, then I, you know what I mean. Then, I, I, then obviously I can't be angry, but I don't really want to dwell on it because we haven't lost the game. <laughs> ideally, I want to see us win the game. Um, and if we win the game, I'm coming on smiling. Trust me. My review will be probably be done inside the service station again, and then have to be uploaded as soon as I get home. Um, whatever time that will be, is what time that will be uploaded at. Um, but no, I mean overall, I'm excited, really excited. I say we're leaving literally in 20 minutes time, so I've got to get this video out to you guys. I'm really tired, as you can probably hear from my voice, from you probably see from my eyes. Just how tired I am, but I'll wake up. Trust me, when the Borough fans start singing in London. I'll wake up. Um, you know, I need to get a morning hot chocolate in me and I'll be smashing. But, uh, nah, excited, man. Really excited. Strong 11. No reasons why we can't go out there today. I just terrorise Fulham. At the end of the day, they know, uh, well, most of the lads have had essentially a week off. Um, been no one playing on Tuesday night. Uh, apart from maybe there's a few that may start today. There's only a couple. Fry and Gibson only had a half of themselves and stuff. So, you know, um, strong 11. Fresh boys today. Tavernier travelled as well. Really happy to see Tavernier travelling with the boys last night. Uh, Randolph put it on a snap with that story. Um, so, ideally, if he plays today, happy days. But Baker's played really well as well. So, be hard to take Baker out of the team. If we give you a quick score prediction, it's not changing. It's staying 2 1 middles, but there will be a goal in it. It'll be a really tough game today. That's what I'm expecting the most part. Fulham won't lie down to us. No way. No team will lie down to middles for this season. We have to put up with it. We have to put up with the attack. Just like we did at Aston Villa, um, obviously that week ago. And if you have to settle for the point, you have to settle for the point. 
I feel like we're going to have to dig in deep today. Um, and we're going to have to just really battle that out for the win. Won't be easy. Fulham are, Fulham are a great side. Um, no matter what people say, you know, they are a good team, good players. Um, sorry about the background today, obviously. Today, this whole background, I can't do it in my room. I've just said, you know, my brother's asleep. And he's got a busy day. Um, and I'll probably wake everyone else up in the house. So I had to find a quiet place in the house, which is my front room. I'm trying to record it here. I'm sorry if you can't really hear me. I'm just going to keep my voice down. But I'm going to go to Fulham in a little while. Well, 20 minutes. I'm excited. You guys, tune into the Butter game. Try and watch it. Try and sing your heart out. No matter if you're in Taiwan or if you're in your bedroom, try and sing for the boys. I'm saying 2-1. Leave your predictions in the comments. Butter fans have a safe journey to Fulham. And let's get all three points up the butter.